G'day guys, this is Dylan here from Outback Equipment and today we're at Lawrence RV going to be having a chat to you about the DI35 couplings, the DI45 couplings and the pin locks that go with them. Alrighty folks, so here we've got a DI35. Now there's two main models with the DI35s, there's an R model and an I model. This model here is the I model. Now the core difference uh, of the R model is it has a separate handbrake, so it doesn't come supplied with a handbrake, allowing you to attach the handbrake further back on the A-frame. Now depending on your setup needs of your A-frame, sometimes you need to sit them back behind your supporting bars in your cross welds, it just depends on your setup mainly. Now there is also another model, which is what we call a DI45. Now that one is not too common, now that one is mainly for your larger caravans that will ATM at four and a half tonne, um, where these three and a half tonne. So the main core features of the DI35, and probably the main reason a lot of actual customers love these hitches is the actual um, articulation on it. So say for example, you're going up um, a lot of corrugated dirt tracks or you're gonna just get off to that beaten track there, you're gonna want to have a lot of good departure angles. So the main reason as you can see here, you've got a full articulation that goes up, basically both horizontal and vertical. You can spin it 360 on its ass. Um, so basically, unforbid, caravan was the roll, it's not going to take the car, car with you. Um, now, a good feature about them is they're 100% Australian designed and Australian patented. So now one thing we do want to touch base is, these units are such a high tech unit, they are an expensive piece of gear, not only that, the caravan that they're towing or connected to is also an expensive fit of gear. Now unfortunately because of that, anywhere from 400 to 600 caravans a year will get stolen. Now. One way to fight that and against that and basically deter the thieves is with a Cruise Master DO3545 pin lock. These pin locks have been specifically designed to suit these hitches. Nice and easy um, setup, all you have to do is drop your pin through the coupling. I personally like to push this unit back here, nice and up so I can see what I'm doing. So once you have the actual pin lock within the hitch itself, just a matter of grabbing your offside hitch, shove it in, Turn your key and lock it. I always suggest putting your dust cap on because that will keep a lot of the dust out or your wops out, keep it nice and free from debris. And once it's in, you're nice and locked and nice and secure. No one's going to be able to come up, hook up onto the van and take your van. Now one thing that I always suggest doing, and always just a little piece of maintenance on it, always ensure you have your dust cap back on because that will keep debris out of it. Now if you do get debris in it, what I suggest is spraying it with some silicon spray, some WD-40 because that will keep the dust and debris out of it. Now, they are fitted with a grease knuckle. I always suggest greasing it. Keeping it greased will provide longevity of the hitch itself, and when they are an expensive piece of git, you want to use it to the best of your capability. Now, if you do want to pick up one of these amazing couplings, either the DI35 coupling, the DI45 coupling, or even the pin lock to suit, you can just head to our website or stop in store. Our website is outbackequipment.com.au. If you have any questions or concerns, please leave a um, comment below, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell. Catch you in the next one.